No doors around here. Although they, I think they were trying to use this one, though. Which is technically a separate entity, but they're like practically touching. Almost certainly related or something. Who's been staying up here? Oh my god, they got the good stuff. Soft toilet paper? Does such a thing still exist? Who's even making it? Okay, just using that jetpack, but not moving. Great. I wonder if I can take out the one mech in the starting zone now. If I reach that amazing pinnacle of myself yet. I think that's all that's here. I don't think I can even get inside the building. Ah. Well, alrighty then. There I see how things are going. Right. Whoa, it hurts. Can't just jump over the wall when there's a dome. Although the damage was not, not too bad. Hello, Sir Gregor. That was weird. He kept reaching his hand. What was he reaching his hand out for? I recalibrated the antenna. Yes, thank you. We've already started to get messages through. We've had to do a bit of clearing up at this end, but that's a minor issue. What do you think? Is the station to the northeast in a good state, or are we likely to get another failure? I'd recommend stationing some people there to defend the antenna. If it were only that easy. There are always other things to demand resources. Oh, well, I'll just have to see if I can persuade the powers that be. Here, this is for you. You shouldn't think that I don't value your service to our cause. But... But Albs. There's Albs there. I didn't get to say that because the dialogue just ended. Obviously it was an option, but I thought it was just a priority to specifically emphasize defending the place. I don't know why that was a choice between the two. It's like, no, specifically, yes. There are albs there. Defend it, please. But it was an or choice for dialogue. Are these all right generic ass farmers? Yep. The page, they're on to you. Better armed is better prepared. You mark my words. Alright. Can't tell her about that. There's Eric. I'm going. Lutz has the energy regulator. Good. The dome should be more stable now. I thank Kalan for sending you. You've taken a side in the Abessa conflict. That's actually the one of the only times it hasn't said that, but I think it just said it earlier in the same quest. Bounty hunter, right to stay. That's the one where I need to find Caleb. Weapons, weapons embargo. Meet with their contact outside the dome. Collect a weapon shipment. I oh, are right outside the dome. Who is Caleb? There's so many damn people in this game. Traveling merchant. Stranger. I have the best goods that you could ever need during your travels. Then show me what you have. Only the best for an adventurer like you. Surprise me. Uh, 16 reduced damage. Really nailing it there. Oops. This is the only weapon. Crate. He sells, uh, blah, 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 blah. Mostly stuff that I don't care about slash stuff that I don't know if I'd even ever want it. Why would I want to buy toilet paper? Is it a thing in this game you'd want to do? Doesn't have a ton to offer. 
So I could try selling things off to him, at least. Please patch tabs into this game. Oh my goodness. Okay. Oh, I don't have that much to offer. I do not. I must have sold recently. Let's just move forward. Let's just move forward, shall we? Part of me wants to just get away from the bugs that make annoying sounds. That guy seems like he's under attack. Hey, you've been out in the wilderness, right? Yes. Well, I'm looking for a guy, and I wonder if you've seen him. He's called Ray. He's an outlaw with a big mouth on him. Bit of a waster. You haven't met him anywhere out there, have you? I've met a lot of people. Maybe I've met him. Maybe I haven't. Yeah? Well, if you do find Ray, can you let me know? Well, I guess that's my questions answered. Ray, you old son of a bitch. I was starting to think you weren't still alive. You know, I am sort of surprised about that myself. Well, 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 here he is. Large as life and right in front of me. I guess this means we really do have ourselves a problem now, don't we? I still want the shards for the contract, or for Ray's hide. So, are you gonna pay me, or am I gonna have to claim on the contract? So you've got one of these contracts. You know about them, do you? Well, yes, I've got one, and I'm gonna claim the reward for it. Give me the contract, or I'll kill you. Now you want to get killed for that, idiot? You'll regret that. Whoop. Ow, how'd you get me? I was so far away. Anyway. The death of Bombi will change the story. Who? What did I... <laughs> Is he important? Well, I guess we'll see at some point. I don't know who the fuck Bombi is, but but is, is they're phrasing it like it'll affect the main story. Damn. I'm just not interested in paying off every single person who's after Ray, so at some point I'm just going to defend him against each one. And they're the ones that are going out on, on uh, risking their lives for bounty hunter contracts. They're taking a risk themselves, is it's how I see it more or less. That's a new warning, though. I've never seen that this, uh, this death will affect the story as a warning before. Hello, dead cleric. Hello, dead cleric. Hello, chest. Ooh, ring of hardiness. And Radox report. You don't seem to care about me opening that. Let's read Radox report. Radok, an, Alb an Alb separatist. The actions of the free people are confusing to me, but whether, whatever the cause, their actions serve our purpose. Their conflicts drain resources and personnel and material rather than focusing their strength against us. The clerics are probably the best of our opponents. They understand us better than the others. They are extremely tenacious. Even now, some of their soldiers are pursuing me. I shall heed. Uh, I shall head south east before they can. Throwing stops there. So clerics are going after him. Well, this doesn't look good for the 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 point that the other separatists are making about just wanting to blend in and everything. Cause this guy seems like he's trying to subvert. You once possessed great Elix abilities, didn't you? You're probably a soldier from Zaykor, possibly even a commander. But you are now free from Elix and from the orders that come from the heart of Zaykor. Have you come here to die like the clerics that I just killed? Or are you here to trade? What can you offer me? The weapons of my enemies. Never used. Dropped once. Well cleaned. You won't find a drop of their blood on them. I have traveled alone since I left Zaykor. And I wish to remain so. Still, if you have information to give me, that would be useful. 
Information and shards are what an Alb needs to survive in the lands of the free people. Not that either of those things help these clerics keep their lives. I might need to reread his message. He might not be from Abessa, just a random outsider. Paige sent me. Paige? Do I know Paige? Faces and names of the free people? They merge into one. But you must mean the woman from the domed city. But I have business to conclude before we speak. It seems there are two followers of Kalan nearby who are anxious to see their god in person. And I must send them on their way. Quickly, decide. Will you stand with me in battle? This is none of my business. You disappoint me. For if you don't stand with me, that must mean you are my enemy. Okay, so he's an idiot. Great. Ow, dick. Fuck. Oh, wow, they're here. Okay. Go away. Why would I- I'm just gonna randomly help you kill some clerics at random that I don't know. Just because they're clerics? I don't think so. Anyway. Click. Oh, I got the weapons. Wait, the weapons are explosives? I thought they were... I thought they were weapons, as in, like, arming yourself with guns, not like I'm going to subvert everything with explosives. That cleric is losing his goddamn mind over there. Red Axe report. Yeah. I assumed he was a... He, because he's local and it's a, a, a Bessa mission, I assumed he was had something to do with Abessa, but he seems to have no mention of Abessa, Abessa of any real kind. Unfortunately, I might have to go against this weapon thing. Collect a weapon shipment. But what I got from him was a bomb? the right one? We'll have to investigate. Also, ow. Uh, canned food. There we go. Now the Alb is dead. Kalan's will has been carried out. Here, a symbol of his mercy. Now, it is time to take the fight to Zekor. May Kalan guide your path in safety until the Albs are defeated. That was incredible. The body he was stumbling over went... Like a rubber band, flying through space. Holy shit. Where did it even land? It's all the way down there. Look at where it landed. Oh my god. It flew all the way down there. Just... <laughs> if I don't remember to edit in like a repeat, just go back to the beginning of that dialogue with the cleric and just watch as his the body goes cartwheeling behind his head, just flying through space. Oh, that was incredible. Oh man, that's special. That's special. This is why we play these games. I'm gonna quick save real quick, because I don't know if I can confront Paige at all. I don't wanna I don't because I don't, I don't know if I wanna give her bombs. If people wanna arm themselves in this place, it's one thing, perhaps, but Straight up bombs isn't like a self-defense arming thing. That's like a I might sabotage the dome kind of thing. And I do want to prior I do want to prioritize keeping this dome safe. No. 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 I just picked up a pack of explosives. I'm pretty sure that's the right thing, right? M package, creative explosives. Yeah. Yeah, it's the creative explosives. No. <laughs> nope, 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 nope. Bombs you, are not. You there. I've been looking for you. You're the person who realigned the antenna, aren't you? Uh. Sure. Okay, yes, that was me. By Kalan. Then why didn't you come to me before? Is it you that we have to thank for regaining contact with the Hort? That is a blessing indeed. And those skills you've demonstrated, well, I have need of them again. So if you can spare some of your time, I have a job for you. Are you willing to help? Yes. Tell me what you need. Well, that's simple. We need to send someone to the Hort to make a delivery. 
So I thought immediately of someone with the requisite survival skills. Ergo, you. You see, we are awaiting the arrival of some combat mechs to boost security, but the Hort requires some additional Elix to get them active. You have already proven your abilities, so would you take this task on? We'll give you the goods. We simply need them delivering. Why are you asking me to do this? Because I need it done and you're here. Come on, take it. It's important. Here, please, take this crate and meet up with our supply party. They will be waiting near a ruined bridge to the northeast. And just so you know, the crate of Elix has been security sealed. Not that I don't trust you, but we have to take necessary precautions, given the nature of this cargo. We don't want this falling into the hands of our enemies. One crate of Elix is enough for a delivery of mechs? No, of course not, but it's enough to deal with their current Elix shortage. And we'd like to get them into operation as soon as possible. That's why we're sending some of our resources to the Hort. The temptation just to, to, to figure out how to bust into a crate of Elex and be like, yep, that's, uh, that's what I needed. Thank you. About the outlaws' weapons delivery. I know who is trying to smuggle weapons into the Dome City. So, you met Paige. We've suspected her for some time now, but we've yet to catch her with any shipments of weapons. But, if my information is right, then she's found herself a new source and is trying to acquire some as we speak. If she tries to get you involved in this business, then do the only thing that is right and bring me what she wants. I have what you wanted. I'm glad to hear it. I hope that the goods are all here. Look for yourself. Good. I wanted the whole shipment intact. Here, your reward. Ah, yes, the weapons dealer. How is he doing? Is he still alive? The dealer is dead. Good. Kalan's judgment is ever-present. You have my thanks, and I'm sure Kalan's as well. Jesus, the quest cancelled sound is horrifying. Sounds like something horribly, horribly has gone wrong. Like the game's like ceasing to function correctly. So securing peace, it's called the one for getting the uh, the mech set up. Could be concerning. But where is Caleb? He just. I just want to get this done. Where's Caleb? Caleb, where are you at? If I talked to Caleb during the quest. Let's see. Because Fank was an alb. No? No, right, he was an alb because he's a separatist. Alb separatist. Yorg is a berserker. Which means Caleb's almost certainly a cleric somewhere. Does he actually mention Caleb by name? The first mention of Caleb seems to be, I should speak to Caleb before I give you any advice. What is the problem with Caleb and Jorg? Is the first thing, the first mention of Caleb is something that I say? Bank doesn't mention Caleb in this in this history. This is so unhelpful. Am I missing something? Then Yorg's mes mentioned. He's accused us of spying for the Alps and Zaycor. Oh, come on, man. You gotta help me a little bit. I even said I should speak to Caleb before I give you advice. Like, but the quest markers don't help you. They only tell you where Yorg is and where Fank is. Where the fuck is Caleb? At some point, like, the, at some point I need the game to, like, give me, like, a... I need, like, a map filter that shows me every named character I've met so far and shows them on the screen somewhere, just so I can even tell. Because even the quest 
The quest has me pointed towards Caleb. Oh, it's, it's always that guy. It's pointing me at Caleb, but it doesn't mention where he is anywhere in the dialogue archive. I'm supposed to just remember him, but there's so many goddamn people in this game. I know somebody in the audience is like shouting at me like, it's obviously this guy or something. How did I get stuck? Or further yet, maybe I'm completely crazy, and maybe I've never met Caleb. Caleb be the other guard? I don't know, Caleb is such a normal-ass name that for all I know I've never met him before and I'm thinking of a character from a completely different video game. Or life. Are you Caleb? Gustav! God damn it. Guard. Daryl. <laughs> they have such regular ass names and they are everywhere. Are you here to pay me those shards you owe me? Because I'm pissed at how long you're taking to pay. Fank. Hey, Fank, help me. No. Fank, you had one job. Tell me where Caleb is. You couldn't even do that. Oh my god, Caleb. Caleb, there you are. A berserker. I can make sure Yorg stops denying his story. Okay, well, fuck off then. Who knows what they're going to find in those ruins next? There's no, there's no alternate information you're gonna get from Caleb. Well, shit. Uh, Yorg moved. Yorg, are you in the bar? Are you outside the bar? Okay, now you're just hiding from me. About this situation with the Separatists. Do you have any idea what I should do? I feel... this is a mess. Go to the clerics and tell them you made a mistake. I can't do that. Caleb will call me a traitor. And for all I know, Caleb is right. That Alb could have been from Zekor. What if Fink actually is an Alb spy? I spoke with Fink. He is not a spy. How can you be sure? Whatever it was I saw, I saw it. Don't you think it's suspicious? And even if this Alb was a separatist, we don't really know what they want either, do we? No. No, it's too risky just to hope he's innocent. I can't say anything to the clerics. If that is your decision. Yes. I'm sorry, but we can't risk it. Not if Caleb could be right. You've helped me decide. Thank you. The Separatists must leave the city. I will go to Caleb and tell him that I won't say anything. Um... Okay... I don't like how it... What is it implying by saying I took a side in the Abessa conflict? I failed the mission. I... I was like, hey, you... He's innocent, it's fine. And then he's like, nah, brah. And then it's like, you took a side. And then it's like, quest cancelled. I'm like, oh, um, 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 uh, might, might do with a rewrite to say that, that instead of taking a side, it's more like you've affect, like, the power, like the power balance has changed in some way or some other description other than you took a side, because you took a side makes it sound like it was your choice as opposed to being a consequence of your inability to make somebody do something, which, as far as I can tell, the, the only option I had was having a suggester or I must have had to choose different options like maybe other options would have been more effective oh well we're committing to the consequence for now now I'm getting the feeling things are not going to be looking great for the albs around here They don't do themselves a lot of fa favors, though, by, well, being Alps. They are members of the group that is terrorizing everyone, originally. Although, aren't Alps, like... Aren't Alps, like, kidnapped people that are transformed in a converter or something? So it's not like... They don't volunteer, do they? I don't know if it's been explicitly said. But I think I've just implied from the whole converter stuff that, like, people become albs. 
possibly against their will. Which makes them more sympathetic of a group. But if they do, but if they become the group, an alb willingly, then it'd be like, well, come on, man. Wow, what a surprise. They don't trust you. It's almost like you did, you know, alb shit. Really? We're gonna have a shady dealing under an overpass? Places like this. Halt! In the name of Kalan! What brings you here? There's no reason to be suspicious. There are thousands of reasons! Because there are thousands of things trying to kill you! Better to be suspicious than dead. But then you must know what that's like out there, or you wouldn't be standing here. If it's that bad, then what are you doing out here? Supply run. We're procuring stores for the Hort. I normally get a bit more backup, though. I'm a logistics specialist, not a combat guy. But with the shortage of men at the moment, I've been pretty much left to take care of myself. And that means I need to be even more suspicious. Where do you go to get your supplies? It depends on what we need. I have been to the gates of Goliath, across Tavar, and to the border of Zekor. Across most of Magalan, really. But the world has become so hostile with the factions turning on each other, getting more dangerous by the day. If it's so dangerous, why do you still do it? Because the Horde always needs supplies. Besides, I do like finding interesting places. Magellan never stops with surprises. I remember some ruins in northwest Abessa that I discovered, right next to the cliff. I wasn't able to take a good look around, but maybe you'll find a suitable opportunity someday. I don't really have time for exploring any longer, and I don't want to get killed doing it. My Thrill Seeker days are long gone. Good luck staying alive. Yeah. Just remember to stay suspicious. It'll keep you alive. About that, I'm not here just for the small talk. Are you the cleric's contact? Were you sent from the domed city? Yes. Then I hope you have brought the Elix with you. Let me have it. And I will take it to Ignadon straight away. Here. This crate is all they gave me. Good. They need this back at the Hort. I'd better get it back as soon as I can. What about my payment? Payment? We get the Elix, and the Domed City gets their combat mechs. That was the deal. So if you want payment, speak to whoever sent you from the Domed City. I should get moving. The sooner I'm back, the better. Kalan bless you, my friend. May he look upon you with the mercy he has shown me. The Hort offers safety to all of us. Okay, bye. Seems like on a regular basis and the there's like a final dialogue where you have one of two choices and if you don't pick one of them, they go away. So like if you ask about the payment, you can't then ask about whether or not you can help them find their way back, or maybe they were going to decline either way, so it was a pointless question, and the game automatically assumes such a thing. So now the only Abessa quest I have right now is for the Bounty Hunter audio logs. Like, I've actually made ma major strides there, I suppose. Almost level 16. Uh oh Bad sound. Whoa, what the... Oh, fuck that. Fuck that. They're like spiders with like teeth. Swamp spider. Oh yeah, that's a skull. That is ouch. That's one of them there skull icons saying you ain't supposed to do this one. It is a bad idea. Ah, oh, no. No. Just want to get away from combat long enough to go look at my map. And just give me a moment. Shit, just go. Uh, let's just do this one to clear it out, right? You know, just for fun. For funsies. Oh, Jesus. Put this one in. Eh. No. I'm under attack in a moment here, so I gotta move. The reason why I'm putting off the, ha the Bounty Hunter one is because it involves going to the Cleric City, which is the one I haven't gone to yet. And I'd like to clean up my existing stuff before I visit another new town again. Let's maybe not do... Oops, not complete. Let's stay away from that one for a bit. Tavar, Fragile Power, Tramp, Confederacy. 
this thing won't clear out. Let's give it a shot. Let's pick a version of this thing that I can do and see how things go. And just go to one of the endings that you can technically do instead of letting it just linger forever, I suppose.